guys, so today it's almost 11 a.m. But now I just decided to start my day. Okay, so now I'm just gonna moisturize. I washed my face earlier, but I didn't moisturize. It's getting a little dry. I told you guys before in the last video that my face is breaking out so bad. And I'm like so sad about it. And the worst thing is, it, is right now I'm going to use my makeup brushes that are not washed. I only used them one time before. And I'm going to use them now and they're not washed. And I just hate using my brushes and my sponge without washing them. Like I wash after every usage because... I'm not trying to be broken out. Like, I don't wanna. I don't want it. I don't want it. I'm just rolling my face. Like, if I could stick to a routine to like roll my face every single morning and every single night, I would have a less fatter face, and it would, it would make me feel better about myself, and it would make me happy. But I just cannot be consistent with nothing for the life of me. Like. What I need to do is to start new habits and track them and to stay consistent because consistency and me, we don't go aligned together in the same sentence. Like, we don't match. We don't match well. We don't go together. We're not together. Consistency and me. But today is March 18 and today is just a day in my life. I'm not doing much today. I'm not doing anything today at all. Um, it's just a little day. And I've talked to you guys about me going through a trauma before in my life. But I never really went deep into it. And today is the anniversary of that trauma. And today is the day that that trauma happened. And over the years, today is the fifth day year. And over the years, today is the first year that it's on the same day, a Monday, that it took place on in 2019. So, you can just imagine how I feel today. It's like a little fresh. I must say, I feel better than how I felt over the past years. It's like every other year gets better. And that's the, the beauty of healing and that's the beauty of coping. And that's just the beauty of getting over things. Like, you're getting over things, but the scars are still there. But slowly by slowly, it gets better. Like, all the other years, I just stay in bed for the entire day and I cry until night. Like, I've cried once since morning and that's it. Like, this is very good to how I normally am. I cry the entire day till night. And I won't cry in once. So it's a win win for me. I showed you guys my last video that I got a sunscreen, an SPF 70. And I haven't tried sunscreen never, ever in my life. So I'm just gonna try today and see. It doesn't smell bad when I sm Ooh, this is too much. Child, I can never get anything right. I never tried sunscreen before. So I'm really excited to see what this is gonna do for me. Protecting myself from the UV rays. Should have been doing that. But it's never too late, right? I still think this is too much. I played myself, child. I think this smells like a doctor office. The best way possibly. So I just gonna fan a little bit. But today I was like thinking to myself do I want to go out today should I go into town today and like go in stores and all that and if I wanted to do that I should have planned it early I'm like you know what I should have went out today I was just mysteriously thinking to myself like I should have went out today but I'm like even my mom said to me that she think I should go out today and like just chill I'm like no I'm not going anywhere I want to film a video I think I should go on a walk also. That would be fun. I'm going to see if I can cover up this black spot right here. I can tell you guys a story about this black spot. It's the most stubborn spot I've ever dealt with in my entire life. It's the worst. 
I'm getting my beauty blender. <sighs> okay. Um, I'm just blending away. I didn't do put too much product because it's hot. It's so hot in the days and nights. It's just so hot here. It's hot in the days, but especially at nights. As I said before, it just makes you want to strip out of your clothes, like everything, every garment that there is, every piece. Is. And it will be hot. But wouldn't a walk be good in this weather? And like taking you guys along with me? Because it's not like I have anything else to do, you know? I could make a smoothie and go for a walk with my smoothie because it would be cold. Last would... night, I went out. And I had the best time of my life. I was anticipating to go out with some people. I, the week before, I invited my neighbor to go out with me to this event. Like, having this football event, a football game, like every weekend. I'm like, I want someone to go with me because I have no one to go with me. Like, I wish I had someone to go with me. So I asked my neighbor. He didn't He didn't go with me the, the other week, last week. He had some people at his house. So I guess that's why he didn't go. But I just wanted to, like, go out. But I didn't go last week Sunday because I had no company. And this week Sunday, yesterday, I'm like, you know what? I'm just going to go by myself. I just cannot bear to be seated in this house even though i went out earlier in the day i was like i cannot bear to be seated in this house tonight like i have to go out i have to like socialize i have to be in the here i have to be in the night breeze i have to clear my mind tonight like i'm not staying inside tonight i'm not and then my sister i told her she come she should come with me she flaked Another person flaked on me. I didn't even go to my neighbor and be like, you want to go with me again? Like, I didn't do that. You know what I did? I got dressed. I got ready. And I went by myself. First, I went to the shops to buy a drink. And then I just came back home. And... Um, I heard like somebody's coming in my yard. My neighbor is here. Give me a minute. Ooh, child. My neighbor just came to me and I just had to run over to his house a little bit to help him with his Wi-Fi situation. So I'm kind of out of breath. As I was saying, yeah. So last night I I couldn't bear to stay in the house. So I, I had to I had to come out. I had to go out. And I was like, you know what? I'm going out by myself, and I'm going to do it, and I'm just going to chill by myself. If someone happens to, like, see me there, and, like, we just begin to bond, and we be friends, so be it. But I'm going to go, I'm just going to enjoy myself alone, and just clear my mind, and it's just going to be so therapeutic to me. But by the time I got home back from the shops, then I went to go and buy my little Sprite, and my little sweet, because I have a sweet too. I was like, I cannot go out there without a sweet. I have to have a sweet. And by the time I came back, my brother, my mom, told me that my brother was calling her. And I'm like, let me check my phone. My brother was blowing up my phone, telling me that he's, he came to my house. He was looking for me. Nowhere to be found. And that he's like being at the same event that I'm going to, like, he's there, I should pull up on him. And I'm like, I was just coming to, like, be there. But let me tell you the crazy the crazy part of this story. So last night when I said I went to, like, the, the little store, the little convenience store to buy my little Sprite and my little sweet, there was this man there. His back was turned to me. And I just looked at him like, you know, this man looks just like my brother from behind. But I didn't pay no mind. It was a lot of men out there. But, you know, when I'm walking, I'm not going to, like, look at men. Because 
I just don't want them to see that I'm looking at them because I don't want any bothering. I don't want any bothering. I don't want you to see that I'm looking at you. I don't want a conversation to be striped. I don't want a conversation to be sparked. So I just glimpsed and I just walked and got my sprite and whatever. Come to think of it, it was my brother that I saw. And I was like, this man looks exactly like my big brother. So I went out there and I pulled up on my brother and we spent the entire night together. Almost 12 o'clock. And we just chilled for the entire night. Him, me, my, my little nephew, and he's not so little. He's bigger than me, but I'm older than him by seven months. It's crazy that we're literally the same age. And he, I'm his aunt. Like, one thing about it, don't call me no aunt. <laughs> don't, please. Don't call me no aunt us and his friends for the entire night i even met one of my childhood friends that i've never seen since i've seen him that time you know when you meet someone and you like when you're a child and like you were playing and having the best fun and you never see that person again well that happened to me last night i met this person that when i was always at my father's house we'll play and we'll eat together and i just met him again last night and i think we're the same age too but it's that's wow the other thing that's happening to me let me tell you guys the craziest thing that's been happening to me the most wild craziest thing so since i would say last week monday no, two weeks or three weeks before that, I've been getting in touch with people that are no longer in my life. Like, they're just coming back. They're just spreading back. The, last night was the third person that was in my life and talking to, to each other in years. The third one in, like, the same year. In less than a month. In less than two months, I would say. Like, to me, it's just so crazy that me and all these people are corresponding again. And these are people that I never imagined that I would ever be talking to ever again. Because it was just so long ago we talked, you know? So, last night, I got in contact with the third person. And the funny thing is that in less than 24 hours, I've been in contact with all three persons. Like, all three persons are my most recent in my text message. It's so wild. I don't know. I hope, I kind of like where this is going. And I hope all the other persons that I haven't talked to, talking to in years, they just sprang out back in my life. And... We just get to relate again. One of them was inviting me to like a beach, a beach, beach going out and like to grab some food. But I don't know. I don't. Maybe in summer, if it was summer, but I'm kind of busy this week. This morning. Oh my god, guys. Let me tell you, I've almost forgot this person. Even though a while ago, another person that was like, uh, was in my life, contacted me like an hour ago. How could I forget that person? So that's like the fourth person. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know what's happening. So I had to run out again to help my neighbor with his Wi-Fi situation again because... It's just not working. So we just had I just get on the phone with the team and they're just gonna work on it and then they're gonna call out as soon as they get any other updates. But I just had to do that again. But right now I just finished got ready 
I love how my makeup turned out today. It's subtle. It's not a lot. It's not crazy. It's just a little, 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 little thing. But now I think I'm going to take my laundry out because it's already dried and just put it away. And then I'm going to take the pictures. And today is so chill. It's so quiet here. It's just so quiet in the day. It's not a lot of vibe. Like everyone is at work, school, out, wherever they are. It's just, it's just, everyone is out. I really want to go for the walk. Like every other time I said I'm going to take a walk, I never. I've said I'm going to take a walk a thousand times in my YouTube videos and I never because I just simply don't like walking, but I am going to. Next week again, I will be taking you, I'll be taking you guys to the football games with me because I'll be going again next week by myself again because why not? Even though I didn't technically go by myself this week because my brother showed up and like invited me unannounced, like that's the best so yeah what is this white thing in my hair i think i got cream in my hair right now i think i'm gonna get up and to like take some pictures and yeah and like respond to some messages because these people have been texting me non-stop that i got in contact with again I just finished taking some pics i may upload them in this video i don't know but i just finished and yeah at this necklace and now it's what time is it it's 12 41 and haven't had anything to eat since morning nothing at all the only thing i've had is water so i think i'm gonna get something to eat right now i think i'm gonna have a coconut bread or something like that and i think i'm gonna eat it up this time i always eat it just like natural but I think I want to taste it hot. It tastes so good. It's so sweet and nice. Hey guys. So I ain't make my smoothie. I ain't worked out. I ain't went on a walk. It's 3 02 right now. And my mom is about to come home soon from work. So. I'm not going to be here by myself anymore. I'm just going to have this orange fruit or juice like right now because I'm thirsty. I haven't drunk anything since I'm already bought water. And I don't know at once and I already showed you guys. Like this is why I don't really do day in my life because if I don't have a structured plan, if I don't have a plan to do something or if I don't have a routine, the days are boring because I'm not doing anything that's of sort. I'm not going anywhere. This is why I I should have went out. I should have went out as I said I was going to. I should have. But I don't know. I don't know if you guys are ever going to see these clips because what am I going to do? And I must put you guys on Fruta orange juice like you guys need to go and try this it slaps like it's here so slaps it's sour but i love sour and orange juices are normal sour too it slaps you guys need to try i'm just gonna watch youtube like i've been doing and i didn't um you know what tomorrow hey guys so i just put on a face mask because i took off my makeup and i'm already breaking out so i had to do a face mask but i have all these dishes to wash like that's crazy Dang it. i don't know if you guys can see me i just suddenly cannot to me back then oh always find the comfort in washing dishes because it was so therapeutic and the water made my nails grow yeah. but now washing dishes is not therapeutic no more it's more like doing laundry like that's my new fun that's my new go-to like it's so therapeutic to do laundry too therapeutic like i enjoy doing laundry which is crazy i was saying that to a friend and was like nah you're crazy I'm like, no. Fun. I only cried once today. Are you proud of me? 
And it was not even like a big cry, it's just a few tears. Only in the morning, and since then, I haven't cried at all. It's so surprising. Girl, this has been going viral, and I'm like, you know what? I need to like check this out and see what it's giving. Hey guys, so I'm here right now to get my lashes done. I wanted to get my lashes done since January, but I had to reschedule. And I was supposed to get them done the same week in January, but I just did not worry to do it. I was like, you know what, I'm going to do it when it's spring break, glow up season. But I'm not worrying doing a i'm not doing a glow up for spring break video anymore so spring break is long gone i'm not doing that so i just decided to do it right now today so i'm gonna get my lashes done and i'm so excited i'm wondering if i should get the lashes done because for the past few days my eyes have been so irritated it just has been itching non-stop but i'm just gonna get it done because i already i already booked the appointment so why not so let's go So I just got back home from doing my lashes and they're all done. I love them. I think I will tell more tomorrow morning if I really do love them. But I just got back home now. I'm about to take a shower and just head into bed. It's just 6.15. It's not late. I'm supposed to go to this event tonight that's keeping right in front of my house at my neighbor's house. But I don't even want to go. We'll see. I was like let's just do it this week so first we're gonna start with like the produce so this is scallions and we have green peppers ginger we have tomatoes potatoes Irish onions bananas and that's it for the producer. Okay, so we're on to the second bag. And this is a strawberry filled fruit cup. And I'm excited to try this. I cannot wait. And we have another one. And the next one. This is a crunch coconut cookies. I like these, but they're too sweet sometimes and it's easy to get tired of them. Right now we have some vinegar, condensed milk, we have seasoning, another vinegar, Ooh, mayonnaise, I love this. And now we have rice. And then we have flour. This is cooking oil. So we have more coconut cookies. We have cheese. Oh, scrum deli yum yum. Scrum deli yum yum. Apple juice. Apple juice. Apple juice. The bleach. Our ketchup. Egg chips. Perfect toiletry stuff. We have tissue. Some more cookies. My favorite mac and cheese, only crab. <laughs> I couldn't do this cookie for me. Okay, so we have two more tissues, more tissues, more tissues. Detergent. We have this pink drink. We have noodles. Coconut rolls. A lot. I have my favorite drink. This solo coconut water. And this is from Trinidad, I think. This is my favorite coconut water. It's so good. You guys need to try this. So I know you guys haven't seen me for a long time because I'm not vlogging as much. 
But right now, it's almost 7.30 and I'm just in bed, laying down. I'm going to eat something right now and then I'm going to get ready to go out to... Ah! I'm gonna... <laughs> I'll speak to you guys later because they're doing dumb stuff and they're being dumb. Hey guys, so it's a lot later now and right now it is 9.29 p.m. at night. I'm going to this football game right now. I should have been there already. I should have left earlier. But I was like weighing my mind if I should go or not. And then I'm like, you know what? I'm going. I'm not staying home tonight. Like, we're not going to that. We're not staying home tonight. We're going and we're just going to have a lot of fun. So I'm fixing my hair again. No stress. How's my hair looking? So I'm gonna fill up my water bottle with coconut water and then we're leaving this place before 10 o'clock. So yeah, that's what we're gonna do right now. I um, literally have no storage in my phone and I need to delete some things. Like, it's crazy. I'm gonna fill my water bottle up with coconut water and then we're gonna leave. So I just finished getting ready and I filled up my water bottle with coconut water and we're about to go for once finally. And it's now 9 37. Why am I just now coming home from the football game? Like, I'm just not going home. It is 11 07. 11 07. I'm just going home. <laughs> Child, not me trying to fix my hair. <laughs> They're being dumb. Edge? Better hope this one don't fall in this water. If that's something. <laughs> 